Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today, we're going to be talking about a very serious topic, the Marburg virus. The Marburg virus is a highly infectious and deadly virus that is closely related to the Ebola virus. It was first identified in 1967, when outbreaks occurred simultaneously in Marburg and Frankfurt, Germany and in Belgrade, Yugoslavia, now Serbia. The virus is named after the city of Marburg, where the first case was identified. The Marburg virus is a member of the Filoviridae family of viruses, which also includes the Ebola virus. It is transmitted through contact with bodily fluids of infected animals, such as bats and monkeys, or through contact with bodily fluids of infected humans. The virus can be spread through direct contact with blood, urine, feces, vomit, saliva, and semen of infected individuals. Symptoms of Marburg virus typically appear between 2 to 21 days after exposure, and include fever, headache, muscle pain, and weakness. As the virus progresses, symptoms can worsen and include severe diarrhea, vomiting, chest pain, and hemorrhaging, bleeding from the eyes, ears, nose, mouth, and rectum. The mortality rate for the Marburg virus can be as high as 90%, making it one of the most deadly viruses known to man. There is currently no specific treatment for the Marburg virus, and supportive care is the only option. This can include rehydration, pain relief, and management of complications such as bleeding disorders. However, several experimental treatments are being developed, including vaccines and antiviral drugs. So, what can you do to protect yourself from the Marburg virus? The best way to prevent infection is to avoid contact with infected animals and humans. If you are in an area where the Marburg virus is known to be present, take extra precautions to avoid contact with bats and monkeys, and do not handle the bodies or bodily fluids of infected individuals. In addition, it's important to practice good hygiene to prevent the spread of the virus. Wash your hands frequently with soap and water, especially after touching animals or people. Avoid touching your face, and cover your mouth and nose when coughing or sneezing. If you suspect that you have been exposed to the Marburg virus, seek medical attention immediately. Early diagnosis and treatment can improve your chances of survival. Now, let's talk about some of the recent outbreaks of the Marburg virus. The most recent outbreak occurred in Guinea in 2021, where there were three confirmed cases and one death. The outbreak was quickly contained, but it serves as a reminder of the ongoing threat of this deadly virus. There have been several other outbreaks of the Marburg virus in the past, including in Angola in 2005, Uganda in 2012, and Uganda again in 2017. These outbreaks resulted in hundreds of deaths and caused widespread panic. Meanwhile, in Equatorial Guinea, there have been 14 confirmed cases since February 7, with 10 of the patients dying, according to the CDC. This is a concerning development, and underscores the ongoing threat of the Marburg virus. The Equatorial Guinea outbreak has prompted an urgent response from health authorities, including the World Health Organization, WHO, and the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, CDC. The WHO has sent a team of experts to the country to help contain the outbreak, while the CDC is providing technical assistance and support. The Equatorial Guinea outbreak highlights the need for continued vigilance and preparedness for infectious disease outbreaks. It's crucial that governments and organizations work together to prevent and control the spread of the Marburg virus and other infectious diseases, and to invest in research and development of new treatments and vaccines. The Marburg virus is a reminder of the ongoing threat of infectious diseases, and the need for global cooperation to prevent and control outbreaks. It's important for governments and organizations to invest in research and development of new treatments and vaccines, and to support public health initiatives to prevent the spread of infectious diseases. In conclusion, the Marburg virus is a highly infectious and deadly virus that can cause severe illness and death. It's important to take precautions to protect yourself and others, and to seek medical attention if you suspect you have been exposed to the virus. We must continue to invest in research and public health initiatives to prevent and control outbreaks of this deadly virus. We will continue to monitor this situation and provide updates as more information becomes available. Thank you for watching, and stay safe.